but just imagine that Futaba is me, a about five foot two girl with uh, straight red locks, and uh, yeah. Listen, I was a kid with no cares of what you went through during your bid and the books. I know emotion spilled over the lid and I wish I could take back all of the things that I did. All of the times that I grew tired of being inside. All of the times I wanted more than what my mom could provide. If it meant that all the guilt and the pain wouldn't be harvested, that's why I took it back to the moment it all started. Then I'd stomach all the boredom I felt and understand you had to take a lot of time for yourself. I promise I'd wait, make an effort to end my issues, knowing that later on I get to spend time with you. Cause now the only flashbacks in my head are the men in suits yelling you're the reason she's dead. And at the same time, I'm counting the days that I'm going to keep myself inside this room till I can join you away from everybody else. So I won't be the reason behind every single time they threw a fit. And people might forget I exist, but when it comes to their life, at least they can't say I ruined it. It's not that I'm not able to stay calm. I just have nothing left from only one of my mom. And if I did join you, would you still see me as a nuisance? Do I really have no room for improvement? If the both of us go where there's no ground beneath it, does that mean I'm of no use in death either? Is that how we're supposed to be wherever I arrive? And would it be the same if my mom was alive after her work? All I know is nothing ever compares to the days when my mother was there. It's all my fault. I wish the days that my mother was there.